you will see. Oh! Hello everybody! <laughs> Welcome! We're playing Outlast. At last. At last. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> he was gonna do the intro but he failed. <laughs> <laughs> so we are doing it for him. Okay then. <laughs> So welcome to Outlast, <laughs> for another of uh, the announcements of Outlast 2, we're gonna play the original one. So I've played the game, but the new Turkish stuff didn't, so uh, hopefully they're not scared out of their minds in a second, but uh, let's go, new game! Woo! So insane! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, let's, I'll, I'll, I'll pick, <laughs> let's pick normal. <laughs> normal? Well, since I already played the game, I'm gonna not play and let these <laughs> guys play. Outlast contains intense violence, so uh, maybe a warning to the audience as well. Contains intense violence, gore, graphic sexual content and strong language. Please enjoy. You are Miles Upshur, an investigative reporter whose ambition is about to earn him an intimate tour of hell on earth. Always willing to risk digging into the stories no other journalist would dare investigate, you will seek out the dark secret at the heart of Mount Massive Asylum. Stay alive as long as you can, record everything. You are not a fighter. To navigate the horrors of Mount Massive and expose the truth, your only choices are to run, hide, or die. So we can't fight? No. So you're a Shit. whimsy little That's gonna be a brick. bitch. Yeah, it's gonna be a bitch. <laughs> uh, so you're a reporter, so the only tool you have is your two legs to run away and a camera. Department of Agriculture Commissioner Salazar said changing weather patterns were to blame for livestock behavior and encourage ranchers and breeders to attend this weekend seminar on Beulah Avenue. Is Beulah it better? Avenue. Yep. And yep. if you're out late tonight, you may see some low-flying helicopters near Silverthorne and Leadville. Seems the Arapaho Park Services will be spraying for an infestation of box elder bugs. But do keep all pets and children indoors between the hours. And no more radio. Nope. So there's radio interference as well near this lovely place. Mount Massive Asylum. <laughs> An asylum. Great. For the crazy people. I love them. <laughs> I'm not surprised. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what happened with this front lights there. Mm -hmm. um, even the lights are aware that we're the horror game. Why does he Ooh, just... I can look around. Yeah, you can look around. Why does he what? just uh, oh, drive to the gate? <laughs> it's blocked. So, from... Uh, an anonymous mailer to milesupshore at gmail.com, so we. Illegal activity at Murkov Psychiatric Systems. You don't know me, have to make this quick. They might be monitoring. I did two weeks of software consult at Murkov Psychiatric Systems facilities in Mount Massive. All sorts of NDAs I am very much breaking right now, but seriously, fuck those guys. Terrible things happening there, don't understand it, don't believe half the things I saw. Doctors talking about dream therapy going too deep, finding something that had been waiting for them in the mountain. People are being hurt and Murkov is making money. It needs to be exposed. So that's, uh, we got an anonymous step from someone inside of the asylum. Oh, it's still a working asylum. It's not uh, a, well, abandoned. An, an abandoned one. I guess we'll see in a second, now, shall we? <laughs> So yeah, for all we know, it's still in business. So there's the camera. Mm. camera. So we're gonna be looking through this thing. All the <laughs> time. Preferably all the time, since if uh, Miles sees something that he records with his camera, he will take a note and then we can read that as well. Mm. To have his uh, opinion on the map. Because the character itself doesn't really speak. Mm. So that's... The asylum. Nice. So the touchpad use uh, gets your notebook up and you can switch between the notes that he makes and the documents that we find. Mm. Cool. So we haven't made any notes yet. Mm -hmm. so. so And that's the whistleblower, yep. which is also the name of the DLC if you uh, are interested. Uh, you can head into that shack on the right as well, the guard, the guard okay. shack. There is no guard, 
which is already weird for something that's supposed to be still operational. I need a password. No, I don't think you can interact with this. But... It's password. password. Just slam it. Last one, two, three. Slam it. <sighs> what the hell? Yeah, he does breed sometimes. So you can lean. That's because... Uh... Fitness. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Drawings. Halloween drawings. Mm, the daughter, the son of the, the guard. Mm. So how do I put up the camera? Uh, I think it's R1. Yeah, there yep. we go. I think it's one of the sticks to enable the night vision. Ah, but you should right probably one. just turn that off. Because it's it's the camera itself doesn't drain battery really enough, but the night vision does. does. Alright. A lot. Alright. <laughs> So don't leave it on if you don't need it. You know, the camera you should. That's the gate closing. Okay. Behind us, so someone is here. That. Okay. So let's try and get inside. <laughs> so square to open the door, and you can hold square to slowly. Open or close the door. So now we added a note. Okay. Mount Massive Asylum. I start feeling sick just looking at this place. Mount Massive Asylum shut down amidst scan scandal and government secrecy in 1971, reopened by Murkoff Psychiatric Systems in 2009 under the guise of a charitable organization. Cell phone reception cut off abruptly a mile out. That was less than a mile out, but. <laughs> More like a jammer than lost the signal. Weird. The Murkoff Corporation has a long track record of disguising profit as charity, but never on American soil. Whatever they thought they could get out of this place has to be big. Might finally be the story that breaks the bastards. <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't break him. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Or me. Might. Do we always have to look through the camera? It's best because otherwise you might miss certain notes that Miles oh. makes. It's not required, no. Look up there. There's someone in the window. Oh. You missed it? Oh yeah. my. Yeah. There. there was someone in the, in the window. Can you zoom in? I think you can, but I don't really yeah, know. Yeah, because I see the, the bar on the top of the Maybe. screen. No, that's no, that's the. And if we push mm. one forward, no. mm. and let's look at the arrows. Oh, oh, that's the one. Ah. I oh, think nice. I think you add a note if you zoom uh, on that window if there's somebody when the guy is over there. But uh, I don't think he returns. God damn it! So I'm gonna try and point you in the right direction if something happens. But uh, so L1, you can hold L1 to, uh, to run. That's something you're gonna need. And then let's try the front door. It's kind of weird that these trucks are out right side. Because those look like military trucks. Yes. But yeah, go ahead and look around. Ah! <laughs> Stop pressing the button. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's go inside. He's not in shape. <laughs> He's breathing heavily. <laughs> Hello? Oh, it's also locked. Ah. Uh -huh. Alright. Let's go We're another fucked. way. Let's, let's take it. a truck and ram it in. <laughs> well, let's just go home. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, that was it. Yeah. Oh, okay. I can crunch. Someone in the window? Yeah, there's a window open over there. Someone there? Looks like somewhat something went through it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, you're a great camera guy. I, I don't think Christoph wants to, to add go in. Notes. He loves the zoom button. So rolling is slowly. Huh? Yeah, that was slowly. Yeah. That was. <laughs> yeah, that only, was it only, yeah, it only works when the door is actually openable. I think there's a ladder on the left yeah. you can use to, uh, oh. to get on the scaffold. Here we go. Oh. No camera. 
Yep. <laughs> How can you hold a camera and go up a ladder? Here you go. Oh, what? Mm -hmm. I hear something. Yeah, of course it's a horror game. You're gonna hear stuff constantly. Oh. So you can jump. <laughs> it was more like a bunny hop, but... Uncharted! <laughs> oh no, not really. <laughs> Oh, someone farted. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was more the sound of a fart than uh, no, the no, wood crack. Like yeah, that was a crouch button. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, oh, no. it. So if it's dark, you're best to just move to a lighter area so you can turn it back off. Or just do it like that. Oh. So now you can use the stick to slightly open or close it. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was. What's this? What, what are you doing? Uh, it's probably looking... something reflecting yeah. inside, but. Turn on the night vision if you really want to see something on that, on that shelf yeah, over there. Yeah. It's nothing, probably. It's a light bug. <laughs> a lighting bug. Oh, where is it? Oh, something happened here. That it just blocked off the hallway. Well, I think it's abandoned. For the most part. So, the TV. <laughs> yep, I thought so. Of course. Nice sound, yeah, stand a little bit closer, <laughs> so we can see the... <laughs> Is this better? <laughs> yes! No! <laughs> Still! <laughs> this is gonna take hours! Is there something behind you? Oh, I know. Because the, the documents you sure. can find are blue folders, that's why I was looking at all oh, the blue okay. stuff. <laughs> Squeeze! Squeeze! Yeah, you can still look in the direction oh, if you're... The light uh, is flickering. Uh, I was oh. thinking you would more say something about the blood or if the place yeah. but <laughs> I don't see no blood. <laughs> I don't want to see no blood. Oh, there's a computer. And there's a battery in the shelf. <gasps> yes. There we go. Password. Okay. Don't don't reload right now, please. Yeah. Because it will remove that almost full battery you have now. All right. <laughs> I forgot which uh, button reloading was. So no problem. Triangle. Okay. Teamwork. Yep. That's this what we're doing. This doesn't look like teamwork. That's teamwork. You That's teamwork right all over the place. You can close. Okay, I hear. Cut off phone. <laughs> hey, a document. A document. So that's what I was looking for. Woohoo! Pick it up. And Let's I check it out. It. Uh, Project Wall Rider. Patient initials V W P H Billy. <laughs> Therapy status. Patient claims to have progressed to self directed lucid dream states. Since they were talking about dream therapy, yeah. uh in the previous document. Morphogenic engine activity observed at unprecedented scale. Continuing stage 4 hormone schedule. And then a bunch of fancy words that I don't really know and then you can take the next oh. page. Billy asked about the st status of his mother's lawsuit against Murkoff and the asylum. This represents a cat catastrophic breach in security. Despite Billy's claims that he discovered the truth in the blood dreams of Dr. Trager. Or Traeger? Note, the only Traeger on company records, one Richard Traeger, is an exec executive from MRD. All orderlies and security personnel must be questioned and video security improved to include analytical biometrics. So this Billy guy is in a psychiatric, psychiatric hospital from Murkoff while his mother has a lawsuit against that same company. Yeah. And he knew that despite apparently people not having told him because that's what they say yeah. catastrophic catastrophic breach in security jesus can't talk <laughs> anymore yeah 
Okay. Hello. Hello. Pick up the phone, damn it. Yes, footsteps. Should I follow footsteps? I think you even leave footsteps if you step in the blood pool and oh, if you now okay. look down, you're gonna leave. Uh, oh, that was. That's the. We don't want to disturb him. Bathroom. We don't want to disturb him. He is breathing. Yeah, we want to go there. He's taking a shit. I hear something. I'm gonna teach them oh. in the doorway. Oh, she is. Yup. And that's where we're gonna go. Blood. Oh man, <laughs> I want to go there. What is this? A shrimp? A shrimp? That doesn't look like a shrimp. <laughs> it's more like someone in tore his intestines out. Right. Okay, mm. that. Nice one. So someone got murdered upstairs. <laughs> oh, not dark. Okay. Oh, okay, that's fine. <laughs> and then you look to your left. Oh. <laughs> what? So that was one of the patients. Um, okay. No, he's gone again. He was just there for our entertainment. <laughs> okay. Okay. No. Okay. <laughs> oh, there was something uh, over something. there. Yeah, someone was walking over there. It's more like running. <laughs> oh, running, yeah. Okay. I don't know how that would even work if you're inside a vent. <laughs> the door is open over there. And I... What's this? You open it. You will see. Oh! <laughs> My fucking god. Yeah, well, I sh you should open it again. <laughs> that's the way forward. <laughs> <laughs> oh my! <laughs> you surprised yourself and closed the door again. Use your camera, cause the, the there's, a, there's a dead body on the ground. It dropped from. Uh, okay. That's what you saw. It scared me. With no head. Yep. And if you look to the left. Oh no, it's a bit further. Never mind. Continue. There's a body. Also without his head. And if you look over there in the bookshelves, two heads. Nope. Oh, oh my god. There's the rest of the heads. Shit, a lot heads. of heads. Oh yeah, I can see the battery drain. No. Keep walking, not there. <laughs> the other side, yeah. Wow, <laughs> holy <laughs> shit. He's still alive. And this guy is still they alive. They killed us. He got out. Yeah, my bad Bavarians. Bavarians. You can't fight them. You have to hide. You can unlock the main doors from security control. You have to get the fuck out of this world. <laughs> okay. And he also, without we added the note, I don't know if you saw the little symbol. Yeah, the lights. Ah. Yeah. Notes. Notes. I'm inside. Bodies everywhere, blood, burn marks, heads lined up like bottles behind a bar. Dead Merkov scientists hung from the ceiling, their badges say Merkov Advanced Research Systems. Merkov's longtime MO has been to profit of the exploitation of supposed charity, fuck the third world and bankroll another billion. How did Merkov think they would make money of a building full of crazy people? They've some kind of tactical cop pinned like a pig on a spit. Tells me to get the fuck out and then dies. Would have been a good thing to hear when I could still leave the way I came. <laughs> so yeah, because now we're kind of stuck here. Since we can't get back into the vent. Okay. It's Miles. It's us you can hear breathing. Okay. So turn it off. Yeah. We're almost through an entire battery already. <laughs> yeah. So this is where we saw that guy running. If you remember, because the uh, fan is on the other side of the... Uh... There's something over there. Oh, that's, that's the vent where we came out of. Okay. So, yeah, you should do it that way. Okay. There's all the other ways are blocked anyway, so... Oh, Squeeze through that thing! 
Squeezy, squeezy. Little fake. Holy fucking bullshit. Hello, friend. Oh, oh yeah, nice. And that's her friend from the title screen. Alrighty then. Now we're really inside. Oh. And who oh, are you, you then? Um, who are you? <laughs> <laughs> that's a other I, question. I see. Merciful God, you have sent me an apostle. Guard your life, son. You have a calling. Okay. Oh, you apparently have a calling. It doesn't feel like it. <sighs> yeah, that must have hurt. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And that guy has also lost his head. Keep this Proclaim side. the gospel, as you can read on top there. Yeah. And, and blood. No, notes? No, what? nothing. You can see it up there. So that was a priest of some sort. Uh, so now we need to open the security door. So that's the front gate. That's uh, the one we couldn't open okay. when we were outside. And we're supposed to open that thing right now. There is a computer. So, oh, uh. Multiple computers. I'm trying something here. It's a bit dark. Okay. Yeah, it's a bit dark. There must have batteries in this room. Well, I don't think there is one actually. That's stupid. Yeah, it's stupid, but oh. but this is the way it should go away. Anyway. This screen has something else. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, it's a what? It's a wallpaper. Ah, <laughs> it's a dead body. Another dead man. You're just trapped, stepped over his cor corpse. Yep. Jesus, I can't talk today. <laughs> okay. It's yeah. also fun funny that uh, if you keep the camera on oh. all the time, you can see in the top left how long we're playing already. <laughs> okay. So pick it up. And that's what's it. Um, another patient. Walker. Walker. Morphogenic engine activity plateaued at roughly 2000 ppm, whatever that may be. And safety progress beyond stage 3 hormone schedule, and then the fancy stuff, MRI scans. <laughs> Consistent with patients' reported dreams, Walker was interviewed in restraints following his self inflicted mutilations. Restraints have had to be altered. Restraints, probably. Have had to be altered to accommodate his enormous size. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, you might already make the link there that the guy that just threw us through the window was actually Walker. Walker. Yeah. Extensive dermal eruptions as consistent with failed morphogenic engine cellular activity. He claims the skin ripped from his forehead allows for a truer way of seeing. So that's why he looks so uh, fucked up. Because yeah. he tore his own skin off. Seems to have some boyhood experience with Tuatara lizards. And their parietal eyes. He has expressed anxiety about his flesh, specifically around his lips and nose. Yeah, we've seen that. <laughs> and tending orderlies should be advised to watch for further self-mutilation. The mental traumas he sustained while serving in Afghanistan seems to be seem to be retarding progression of the ME process. His predominant fixation, amplified by therapy, is a manic exaggeration of military security protocol. A continuation of both chemical and physical restraints is highly recommended. Mm. Well, that kind of failed. <laughs> yep. <laughs> totally. Already then. Yep. Another computer. Nothing over here. No, it doesn't look like it. Because most of the interacting. Oh, interactive oh yeah, I already know that. Already Maybe it's because did. you need it. <laughs> okay. so that's. Okay. Oh, yeah. There's someone in a wheelchair. Crazy. It's still alive. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yep, it's still alive. So I should go the other way then. No, you should go that way. Uh, no, I should go the other way. <laughs> Hello? Open the door. Open the door. Uh, <laughs> it won't happen. Jump scare? Okay. <laughs> Sir, will you please leave me alone? You can push his wheelchair into the wall. <laughs> <laughs> He doesn't see me. No, he doesn't hear you at all. Breathing like a asthma me. patient. What should I do? 
I don't think you can even fit on his left side. Just go to the right. <laughs> just do it quick. Come on and look at him. Yeah, you might take a look because he's. Could, uh, he, could, he also he did some mutilation to himself. Stand up. Yeah. It's fine. He's friendly. Look. Uh, Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he looks so happy. For a while, before he. Look, his friends! Oh shit. And we should go that way. Yeah. I, I don't know if that's a good idea. A crowd of broken men watching a dead channel. They look like patients. They survived whatever happened here, but nobody's home. In their heads, because. Uh, <laughs> so that means you can probably just. Uh, okay. We're looking at the bloody. We're so I need to go inside. Yeah. Yo. Okay, here we go. Hi guys, don't mind me. Just uh, okay. He is not looking at me. Oh, there's another man over here. You Can should I go the long way. Yeah. Doing? yeah. Okay. Don't mind me, guys. I'm not here. You know what? You can even look at the television for a second. There's blood. No, there's blood on. The yeah, there's blood on. The Someone died over there. Don't oh, mind don't me. See us. I do not want to die. Why there's, is it? there's apparently some woman screaming in her ears right now. Stop screaming! Um, need to crouch on their... Yeah. They Someone. are annoying! <laughs> Someone break the TV. This door? Yeah. So we're looking for uh, for the key keys. Oh, it's... Yeah, you're still crouched. <laughs> I don't think you can open... What is... Someone in a chair over there, and I think he's kind of dead. <laughs> I didn't want to do that. <laughs> that was fucking creepy. <laughs> Squeak! I didn't want to do that, but I did. Okay. Yes. Okay, yeah. It's dead. You just walked. Yeah, past I know. The living one. You say ones. it's dead, but once I'm there, he's gonna Look, jump the badge, scare me. The badge, take the badge. Thank you. Lay down. No battery uh, over no here. I'm not really sure, oh. I don't know if all, ah. all the batteries. Update. Something in the documents? No, 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 no. notes. No. What? What did collected objects? It just says collected objects, so <laughs> you can also view them. Menu. So let's go to the security uh, office. We have to, uh, oh no, we have doors. to go back. You have to go back. Oh yeah. Uh, now Definitely. they are going to fo follow me. <laughs> That's the, the same, same guy. <laughs> He's still sitting there. And They're still yeah. just friendly watching the television. Hi guys. Look. But the woman... The woman isn't screaming oh, anymore. No, there's no, no screaming anymore. Yo. Bye. Yo. And he's just sleeping in his wheelchair. Yeah, I don't believe that. <laughs> do something, I knew it! I knew it! <laughs> There to rip them clean. You gotta help me. What the fuck? No, that's it. We just have to follow him. No, he will die. Oh, no, he's just gonna go cry in a corner. So that's a sort of five. That's a, a patient who survived. Yeah. But he looks fucked up. Kind yeah, of. we don't really know what's going on right now, so. Uh, the only thing we have to go on right now is that uh, we have Walker as an example that he ripped his own skin off because of the dream therapy. So uh, something similar happened to most of these guys. They started wounding themselves. Okay, so I have to go to that door or this door? Uh, we need to open that door, but it's uh, monitored by a security officer. We need to go to the security office with the badge that we just found. Uh, yeah. Because we have to find the security office. I think there might be a document behind the desk, the, the desk here as well. Don't jump up. He's dead. Keep... Well, usually the dead guys stay dead in this game. Luckily. Notes. Uh, blah 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 blah. Catastrophic security failure of a psychiatric center with imminent danger of environment contamination. We are satisfied satisfied that the affidavits and testimony establish 
sufficient evidence to require urgent action on the part of MHS and grants for the issuance of this warrant. So that's probably the military guys that came inside mm -hmm. and got slaughtered like pigs. You are hereby required to grant MHS full access to all facilities and surrender complete authority to its agents. By acceptance of this document, you and any surviving relatives surrender all claims of litigation against the Murkoff Corporation or its subsidiaries for the actions of MHS or the circumstances with which required their actions regardless of responsibility. <laughs> wow. <laughs> what? Thank you for that last word. One word. word. All right, then. Yeah. So the security office is in the, in the back. In the back? Yeah. An empty wheelchair. So that's a lot of that's the door we couldn't uh, open. Yeah. That's the other uh, side. That's another door. And, uh, oh, yeah, okay. lots more blood. Let's look at that one. Security room to the right. Note that you yeah. can look behind you by holding L2 or R2 while running. L. Are we gonna need that? Well, it's maybe a good idea to remember L2? that L L1 is the run button. Yeah. You don't need to hold. really... For what? I didn't yeah. know. While running. L1 first L1. for running. And yeah. while you're running, run. Yeah. Run through the hallway. Yeah. And then... Oh, shit. Ah! Um, you might want to... No, he's, he's gone. Run, oh, he's and gone. Then, and then, and yeah. then try the triggers. Triggers? Oh, okay, so yeah. You can look back while you're running. Okay. So in the future, if something, something is chasing us, you can... Uh, uh, yes. I think there's a battery in this room. With there's all the something else and a battery yeah, in this a, room. There's <laughs> lots, of, lots of heads and body parts, but... Oh yeah, wow. I see. Let's put some more heads in here. And bodies. But the blood really Look. spatters. And batteries! batteries. Oh. Yeah, that's great. The door closed. Oh. But no. That's because the guy... We got the battery. Yeah, we're gonna be fucked in a minute. I know it. A power switch! <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna give you five more minutes. <laughs> You'll see why. <laughs> Just open the fucking door. Oh, it's the wrong. It's the other side of the yeah. screen, you know? <laughs> you can check the toilets if you want. I oh, yeah. Check the toilets. Toilet. Oh, yes, okay. It's gonna be. Just leave. There's no one in the hallway. Lean back. There's only a lot of blood in the hallway. Yes. Oh, there's a man open, over here. Open the middle one. Open the I middle don't one. want open, to. Open the middle one. <laughs> no, you can't do anything. Through God, that's it's funny. When you zoom in, you hear his breathing more. <laughs> okay, be fucked. Witness. Yeah, we're witnessing. Jesus, guy, take your pills. Okay, oh, that's, that's, a, that's a an arm. Wow. We're gonna flush that one through. <laughs> I don't think you can actually flush the toilets. <laughs> so they wasted space for another toilet. To Beatrice? Yep. Yeah. Okay, no, then. Beatrice. As the engineer who did it. That's a bullet hole. Mm -hmm. Nicely seen. Security office. Yeah. Yay, we're here. There's Since nobody there. There's nobody here. Did it. Open the door. On the other side, my man. But it's not uh, very clear which way I have to push the door. There's a keyboard. Yes. Unlock the doors. Let's drink some we're coffee. Gonna, we're go probably gonna see something funny on the screen. I see it. I see it Check on the, the, the right the screen. Right. Oh, I saw some. Oh. You see? What is he doing? Oh, he's looking at us. Ooh, he did it on purpose. Come on. Oh. And yay. now I'm gonna give you a tip. Get into uh, one of those lockers. Because he know we're uh. here. Oh. <laughs> wow. Yep. That's Mr. Walker. Hello. So this is where the real game begins. <laughs> so if I didn't crawl in the cabin, he would have probably ripped your head off. Hmm. 
Is he nude? Yeah, he is. He's naked. I think he's wearing pants, though. I think he is wearing pants. Hello. Bye bye. So wait a second, because you can hear his chains rattle. That means he can hear you uh -huh. too. So that's just a sign that he's near. So once you stop hearing that... Oh, is he going back? Yes, he's going back. Nope. I think he just grabbed his pants, but... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think he's gone. If you can see. So now the lights are mostly oh, out. Oh no, I need my Beatrice. Uh, and I don't know if you saw what the game told you to do next. But we need to, go to, the basement. go to the basement and restart the generator. Nope, I was crapping myself. So we saw the staircase to the basement Yeah, a few seconds ago. Yeah, that's the way. He went the other way, so we're good. Yeah. Well, yeah. for him, at least. Yeah, you're crapping your pants, I know. <laughs> and that's the staircase. Oh. You can turn it off. Okay. That's just a signal that your battery is almost out. Well, there's a water leak. Oh! Um, better put it on. Just a sec. Well, now that we're in the basement, you want to switch controls? I know he loves to switch Because this is the, the next level, so to speak. Oh, I hear some. That's just the music. Oh, a document. I will take the document. And read the document. Yes. Uh, there are the notes. <laughs> Hypnotic experimentation and research. February 10th, 1954. That's old. MK Ultra program, CIA document. On Wednesday, 10th of February 1954, hypnotic experimentation and research work was continued in Building 13 of the Mount Massive Preserve in Colorado using the following subjects. A post-hypnotic of the night before, pointed finger, you will sleep, was enacted. Mrs. Jackson and Pierce immediately progressed to a deep hypnotic state with no further suggestion. Miss Pierce was then instructed, having previously expressed a fear of firearms in any fashion, that she would use every method at her disposal to awaken Miss Jackson, now in a deep hypnotic sleep. And failing this, she would pick up a nearby pistol and fire it at Miss Jackson. She was instructed that her rage would be so great that she would not hesitate to kill Jackson for failing to awaken. Miss Pierce carried out these suggestions to the letter, including firing the unloaded pneumatic pistol gun at Jackson and then proceeding to fall into a deep sleep. After proper suggestion were made, suggestions were made, both were awakened and expressed complete amnesia for the entire sequence. Miss Pierce was again handed the gun, which she refused in an awakened state to pick up or accept from the operator. She expressed absolute denial that the foregoing sequence had happened. Okay. So I don't know if you know this, but yeah. the CIA actually, it's not just this game, actually did experiments of that kind yeah. to see if they could program humans to do stuff and to get works. activated by a certain... It works, because I've seen, well, seen it on TV. That's a bit of a stupid <laughs> reasoning, but I think it works. <laughs> It could work. Yeah, it could work. And, awesome. and I think the name is actually correct also. It's uh, MK Ultra. So, yeah, control switch. Sorry, Miss Jackson. <laughs> it's okay, first controllers. 